Let's wait. Recording in progress. All right. Uh, good morning, everybody. Today is Daf uh, Gimel. <laughs> got a lot of ground. Got a lot of ground to cover. Had an important sugyas. So we le- left off the mission of Chav Beis and Abeis. Shreich Levi for Sabanin filling in. Hakol Kshelich Tovis. I get everyone is cautious to go ahead and write a get page Chav Beis on the base. Okay. Right there. One more turn. There you go. The Mishnah. So everybody is kosher is, is is allowed to go ahead and write a get for a woman, even a deaf mute, a person who is uh, has gone crazy, a minor. Aisha says Gita, a woman is allowed to go ahead and she sells salah earlier, is uh, is allowed to write her own get, even though it's supposed to come from him. So she could basically provide it, write it, and then be makna over to him. And the husband, right, who wants to go ahead and be given a receipt after he pays for Ksuba, he's allowed to go ahead and write the, the receipt and then be makna over to his wife. Because the reason why um, they can go ahead and write the get is because um, the whole main issue is this, this is the signatures and not necessarily the writing. So Zak the Gemara, I, how can you say they can write? They, they are not a bardas, mm-hmm. and as Raj points out, right, or the Pshara of the Gemara, is that it has to be Lishma. Right? We keep talking about Lishma, Lishma for her, for her, but if a Cherish of the Kotan does not have the ability to go ahead and make it Lishma. So Gemara says, top of the page of Chav Kimmel with Aleph, This is because there is somebody, there's a Gadol, who is standing behind the Cherish of the Kotan and basically telling him how to write it so it's like it's Lishma. Supervision. Samarle supervision. Samarle rep. Not going to let out. Sitting in front of the woman, and so they know this is the person. Well, no, 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 it's not true. It's not true. This is Chayyim Shadu Katan. They have no that right. In other words, they're not. No, they're just bringing. Well, the next thing, so right? Isha Kutev is Gita. He thinks she's right there. So Amarle Rav Nachman Elamiata. I think Chavim he saw Elamiata Gabov. So we're going to say if there's Avi Chavim writing and he saw his stands behind him. How can Ami the question is okay? But he came out in Ami. We're going to say yeah, it is. I got time going to buy some other kachavim puzzle, right? And now yeah, other kachavim. Like, why? Because my answer is no. Other than kachavim, the dati, the nafshi of it, he is writing on his own. In other words, in a case of cherish of katan, so the, right, they're not writing it. You know, so they're just doing what they're being told, right, by someone behind. But a, 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 a gadol, I know, i.e., other kachavim, he he has his own das, right? So he's writing for himself. So therefore, that's the reason why that wouldn't work. And how the Rav Nachman Lad Milsi? No, Rav Nachman was crazy. That's not even true. Dami, why? Mid the kapas to lay lavi kachav and lean hava. By the fact that we point out to say that when they're pasul, they can't go ahead and and bring it right. As we'll soon see in the mission later on. Mechal and then exiva kasher. So you can infer from here that exiva they could go ahead and write it. So if that's the case, how could they go ahead and write it? Vatanya avi kachav and pasul. So I you say avi kachav and pasul. So he Rebbe Yezri, the Amar the Amar Eide Mesira Karti, the Ina Ksiva Lishma. So here's the part of Kuta for the Zemachlekes. So that which goes ahead and says they're pos, they can't go ahead and other come and can't write it. Why is that? Because if you hold a the Mesira Karti, so in other words, what the giving over of the get is the important part. Okay, not the signatures. So it has to, how is it lishma? If it's, the important part is not the signature, it's rather giving over. So therefore it has to be ksiva lishma, it has to be written lishma. If it has to be written lishma, then avik chavim is no good. But if it doesn't have to, right, then right, the, the, then avik chavim would be able to do it. So therefore, according to Rebbe Yezer, so therefore you'd say that you need ksiva lishma and the, the guy can't do. I have a vada of chavim that died in the covet, right? So uh, and and uh, we see over here because over there in this case that the the Avi Chavim is doing it on his own and not doing it for anybody else. And Amar Rav Nachman, Amar Rav Meir says Rav Nachman and Rav Meir, Afilu Matzah be Ashba. You can find the get in the garbage. Kosma of Anasin La Kasher. If he signs, he gets there. It's Kasher. Why? Because it's the Chasima, right? It has to be signed Lishma. So therefore, even if it was really Lishma, i.e., found in the garbage, right? Which is from the bookstore, right? So it's not written Lishma. Right, so therefore, it uh, as long as it's signed lishma by two kosher mm-hmm. witnesses, it's okay. Say, say, Rav Lo Rav Nachman. How could Rav Nachman say this? Rav Asa Kasha Rav Nachman it says because of law. It says because of law, and we learn from there it has to be lishma. 
So my law, Ksivas Hagaz, is not referring to Ksivas Hagaz. It has a Vikas of law, right? For says it law, Chasima Satan. No, what does it mean, Vikas of law, right? It means uh, for to write to sign for her, Lishma, as long as these witnesses, right, who sign on it, right, are, are doing a Lishma, right? Okay, this is for her. We're signing it. That's okay. Say, say, Rabbi Kol Gatsha Nichtash Lo Lishum Isha Apostle. So any get that's not written, it says I finished not written for a specific woman as possible. So Ema Shen Nichtam Shalal Lishum Isha. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I was here last couple of days. So I say, Shekaisa Gilu Kaisa Lishma. So, in other words, excuse me, sorry, for Ema Shenechem, so the answer is Ema Shenechem Shalal Lishem Isha. Awesome. So, say it the other way that as long as it wasn't signed, Eisve, so that's not a Kashik, Shu Kaisvo. When he writes, a Kilu Kaisa Lishma, right? And now, when he writes, it's like he's writing Lishma. What does that mean? My Lak Shu Kaisa Vataref Lishma, Kilu Kaisa Lataifes Lishma. As long as you write the Taref, right? The Taref is the important part, right? That it has. Uh, the date, it has the names, uh-huh. right? So that, as long as that part is lishma, everything else is lishma. But you see over there that if, if you're trying to say that everything is lishma, you see that it has, that it has to be written lishma, right? It's not just signed lishma, but over here, this seems to say that it's not the chasima that has to be lishma, it's the kasiva, because we're saying as long as you do the tairef, it's as if the tairef is also lishma. So if you want a garbage, one be good. So then... If you find one that's in the garbage, one be good. Right, because if the, the tairef was... Right, right. Plus, it had blank spaces. Well, right, because then you come out if the Torah, the, then the Toifes, the right? So the says, No, what it means is if you sign it, Lishma, then it's as if you wrote a Lishma. So now, yes, even if it was all filled out, you sign it, it'll be okay. Or if you say, man, if you boy say, ma, honey, must need some money. Who's his opinion? Who's the author of that? Then it's Rabbi Yazi, Dabar, Aidim Asira, Karat, you hold Aidim Asira. We saw earlier, right? The Aidim Asira, if you, you hold the Asira, is important. The signatures are not. So therefore, the Lishma has to come through the Ksiva. Right? All right. So that is the opinion of Rabbi Yazi, Dabar, Aidim Asira, Karat, and Rabbi Huda, or Shmuel, who Shashayer, Makam, Atayrf. And that's only if you go ahead and leave a space for the Tayrf to write even that part, Lishma. It's according to the opinion of Rabbi Yezer, who says there has to be Ksiva Lishma because you have to write the Torah of Lishma. Rabbi Zreka, he says, no, this is Eina Torah. What do you mean, my Eina Torah? What does it mean? It doesn't, it doesn't make sense. I'm Rabbi Yama. Kan Odiyach Hashem Karach Lishma, right? So over here, right, uh, we, we, now the whole point is that it doesn't have to be, right, Lishma. Because it could be, you have those whole Torah, that as long as you do the Torah, then it's as if it was written Lishma. Just say, it goes according to the pin holes, Ede Chasima, right, Karti, and therefore you don't need any Ksiva Lishma. That's why even if you find it and you fill it in, you don't need to go ahead and fill in the, the Torah of Lishma. Because none of it has to be Lishma, as long as you hold Ede Chasima Karti. So therefore, it's not true the way you're trying to interpret it. I So I, how could you say it's a mayor? It's Rabbi Yazhi. So he say, as a my answer is I'm right. You know, I leave with Rabbi Yechon. So my colleague is I'm right according to Rabbi Yechon. One hell that that which says that if you find it right that uh, you can use it, it means that uh, the corner of the Yezer, you have to go ahead and write the Torah Lishma, and therefore that would be okay. Mm-hmm. And the other opinion holds, no, that which you find, you can go ahead and use it because we don't need to see that all to be Lishma as long as we have the Chasim Lishma, and therefore there's Machlech Yezer Fine. When the, when the CRC does the get, do they write a new get, or do they have like a, a form that they just fill in the names and, the, and everything's done? I'm, I'm, I'm they're guessing... They're right right. Yeah, I think they... I, they have, they had the silver comes right. 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 The whole thing. 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 The whole Right, right. Mm-hmm. So Mishnah says, Nay Mishnah. Mm-hmm. I told Shay will have you. So we, we referenced this before. Everybody is kosher to bring a get, basically to be. Uh, let me find that. No, right. fine. Everybody's kosher to go ahead and bring the get. Except for 
a deaf mute, mm -hmm. a shaita, a katan, and also included in here is a suma, a blind person, and avi now let's say the time they get, they were given the get by the husband to go ahead and deliver it to the his wife, he received it when he was you know twelve and a half the week before his bar mitzvah, and then by the time he delivered it, he was ready bar mitzvah. Or all these other cases, he was uh, he was a deaf mute then, and then he was a kech and he got better. Or suma, he was blind. Benis uh, and then he was able to see. He was crazy, he was deranged, and then he became normal. And he was first of all, then he's guy, and then he became a guy. Apostle. <coughs> all these cases are apostle because when it was given over by the husband, it was not given to a, uh, a person bar who das. could, uh, right? Oh, well, we have a summa, we'll, we'll soon see the bardas, but it was not given to the mm -hmm. kashi we'll say. But let's say if he was a deaf mute, that he got better in the middle, then he became deaf mute, or or he wasn't able to see, excuse me, he was able to see, and then he got blind, and then he was able to see, or right? So it says, that first he was um, okay. And then he then, then he became crazy. Then he was okay again. Kasher, all these guys are kasher. Zekla, kolshet, tichlas, v'seif. But that's kasher. As long as when he was given the get, or he or she was given the get. Uh, actually, they're all he's, I think, right? Um, yeah, but we, we're, right, it could be both. It could be either one. Yeah, yeah. No, no, I'm saying the shaliach over here. We, we didn't exclude a, a woman can go ahead and bring a get, right? But the point is that as long as the person receiving the get from the husband is okay to be shleich at the time, and it doesn't matter what happens in between, and the delivery of the get, the person is okay, then uh, it is kasha. Fine. Zak So, bish, la mafresh, the kata, la b'nei dea, and inu. I understand why you say they can't go ahead and be a shleich and be a because they're not a bardas. And oi v'kachavim nami, also the oi v'kachavim, the la v'baratei because I think the not really shy to the halachas of Gitan and Kedusha. Ella mm Suma, -hmm. but a blind person, why can I go ahead and deliver it? Am I low? Because he doesn't know he's blind. He doesn't know who's exactly giving him the uh, the get, and he doesn't know who exactly he's delivering it to. Samath, Rav Yaisev, hey, Suma, Motel Yishto. See, if a blind person can't recognize people, so how could he go ahead and ever be with his wife? Or how could he be with her wives at night? Perhaps it's uh, you know somebody else. Ella, but to be a saina, right? Uh, the color, rather, they you know when they talk to the person, they have a sense of who the person is. They, 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 they by the sound recognition, right? They, they talk to the person, they hear the person, they, they know who it is. They can still identify, right? If they're blind, so the color. So over here, why'd you say in the same case? Why'd you say in this case over here that a blind person's fine because he can recognize the person through through speech, right? For hearing it. And so uh so what's the issue? No, so what's the case of chutzarts? Why? Right? You have to say, I witnessed the writing, I witnessed the uh, the signing, but a blind person cannot go ahead and make that statement. So therefore, he's not able to go ahead and to bring from chutzarts. Below the mats, the mayor, he's not able to go ahead and say if he's blind. So I'm really about Ilamiata, Pasuch, Venistama, Mats, Dematsiam, Rahafianam, the Kasher. So what about this? A person was able to see. He saw it was written in front of him. He saw a sign in front of him. He went ahead and took it. And then all of a sudden, he became blind. So, but he's still able to say it was written and signed in front of me. So I, according to you, that should be okay. But he says in the Mishnah, uh, we learned from the Mishnah, Pasuch, Venistama, Vachaza, Venispatech. If he was able to see, then he got temporarily blinded, then he was able to see again. Kosher. It sounds like only if they recovered and able to see again when at the delivery. But they're not able to deliver, and it would not be good. So the said, Love, no. Who had been the Afal God? So now, even if the blind person, right, he as long as he witnessed it, then he became blind, he's able to deliver it as a blind person. I, the mission doesn't say that. So I did only because it says only if he was, uh, if he was uh, good, then it became deranged, and then it became good again. Only that case is good. 
So only in that case, if he got better, then he's able to go and deliver it. But if not, therefore it also wrote the same case. He wanted to write the same cases of he was okay to see, became blind, he was able to see again. But really that case is Lav Davka. That case is even, so the, the case of blind is the only unique one that if the person as long as able to witness the writing and signing, even if he became blind, he would be able to go ahead and deliver it because he knows who the woman is because of mm -hmm. sound recognition. And he knew who the husband was through sound recognition, and he was able to see at the time of uh, the witnessing of the writing and the um, and the signing. And Rav Asher Diganami the Kanani Zaklal it says the word Zaklal Kol Shet Chelas of Asayfa Bedas Kasher because it says over there where the beginning of the end was with Das is Kasher like Tani Kol Shet Chelas of Asayfa Bekasher is Kasher right so Shlami so it says over there it's not talking about Kasher in terms of delivering it rather it's talking about who's a Das and he therefore the Summa would be okay. Fine next Sugya. Can an Eved uh, be Makabal a get uh, for on behalf of the woman? Um, mm -hmm. for, uh, even if he's an Eved of anybody else, doesn't have to be her Eved. Let's say he's just an Eved uh, Kanani. Can he be a Shalech to be Makabal a get? Because you have to give it to the woman. So, or give to somebody, you can't just leave it on a table and then do it. So, can he be basically the recipient by him uh, uh, taking the, the get from the husband or a shaliach? Can this Evan be kind of or get it on behalf of the wife? So, why she has the shaliach like have a get? The get, Isha Miad Bay. So, Amar Lahum, the Kapasal lay the Avik Chavin. By the fact that we passel for Avik Chavin, right? Because we say, right? Uh, our mission only says, right? Hakok Shay Lovi Saget, right? Knows one could be a Shaliach even both ways, whether to receive it on her behalf or to give it on the husband's behalf. It only matters Ovi Kabim, and it doesn't say, so I've been the couple husband of the Kabim, Michlal, turn the page, my pages, right? Michlal, the Evid, Tasher, right? We get inferred from here that an Evid is okay because it just says, right? Ovi Kabim and not Evid, right? Because Evid Kanadi is more Shaykhis to, 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 to the Jews. Some of Asi, I'm Rabbi Yechna. No, a the Eved Nasi Shulach Chavol Get says in the name of Rabbi Yechna. We're going to be asking him that Eved cannot. A the Eved Nasi Shulach Chavol Get. Isha Miad Baila Lafish Eino B'Taras Gitin the Kedusha. Why? Because they don't have typical the same laws of Gitin and Kedusha, and therefore, since they do not have the same laws of Gitin and Kedusha, therefore they should not get involved and cannot be a Shaliach for such a case. So Maskevah Rabbi Lazar Tamad and Milsa de Lesse. So you're telling me that only it's something that they're not shaykh to, right? That they can't be shaykh. Chal Milsa de Isay Kasha. But if something they are shaykh to, right? Then they could be a shaliach. So Vah Avi Kachavin Vah Kusi. Well, let's go Avi Kachavin Kusi. The East Nu B'Taras Truma the Nafshayu that they're actually able to go ahead and uh, they give Truma. In other words, the Tanan Avi Kachavin Vah Kusi Shetarma Mishalahem Truma So Truma. If they go ahead and give truma from their fields, it does go ahead and become truma. Why is that? Because their ownership of land in Israel doesn't really take away, right, the the, the kedusha of Eretz Israel. Therefore, this produce is actually owned. It's Jewish land because it's on mm -hmm. in the land of Israel, and therefore, since Jewish land, they have the the kayach to go ahead, just like they can able to go ahead and be uh, be makra of a korban or, or uh, be misnada, right, make a nether. To bring a korban, so too they can make like this nether to make something kedushas truma. So you see that they are shayich to truma, right? So therefore, if they're shayich to truma, they should be able to be a shaliach for truma. I but tonight we go to another mission. Avi kachavim shetarim shel Yisrael afilu bereshus. Avi kachavim went ahead and took truma for a Jew, even with bereshus and truma so truma. The truma does not work. So you just they, they do their own, and it's okay. They do their own, it's okay because they don't really own the land in Eretz Israel, and therefore it's a kedusha, and they're allowed to go ahead and make a nether by a carbon, so they can go so to make a nether, basically quote unquote nether when it comes mm -hmm. to truma. But you see over here, they are shy to uh, truma, yet mm -hmm. they can't be shliach. So you said before your whole svar was because they're not shy to get in the kedusha, they can't be shliach. Well, we see it's uh, it's no shaykhus. So my time, a lot of the Chassid, the Pazit says, Gam Atem. Pazit says, Gam, next word, Gam. So Ma Atem Yisrael, Avshalu Chaycham Yisrael. So over there, right, Yishlichim, they have to be Yisrael. So it has nothing to do with, oh, oh, so according to this, right, uh, uh, so an uh, Abed, right, is not Yisrael. So I'm going to be Rabbi Yana, no, no. Ma Atem B'nei Bris, Avshalu Chaycham B'nei Bris. 
Just like you are bnei bris, right? The bris milah of yichav is not bnei bris. So too, yishlicha uh, uh, cannot. But an eved kanani, right? Who does have a bris mila, right? Because he's owned by his master. So therefore, he would be shaykh to be a, a shliach. And Rabbi Chiyah bar Rabbi Rabbi Yechanan, Eina Eben Nasser Shleich Lekabel Get Isha Miad Bayla, the Vishe Eino B'Tayras Gim Nekedushim. So similar statement, send the name of Rabbi Yechanan. An Eved cannot be a Shleich to be Lekabel Get Isha Miad Bayla because it's not Shleich to get in the Kedushim. The Afal Pishe Shanino, even though we learn over there, Harei At Shivcha, you will will remain a Shivcha, my uh, right, my maid servant. However, but your fetus, she was pregnant, is, or actually, I jumped the line, right? So, Avlada, but in your fetus, will be free. And and she was pregnant, then she is at this time when the child is born, and the child is born free, despite the fact that she is still owned by her master. So, what's going on here? What does this mean if she was, she was, uh, pregnant is that then she uh, merits she's able to go ahead and basically be a shaliach of the uh, of, of the cheres for the uber. So ki also Rav Shmuel Rav Yehuda Rav Yechanan Tarti Amar really saying two things. Mirin Dvar Shavim Mekabel Get Lechavero Miad Rabo Shel Chavero Avalo Miad Rabo Shelo. That there's a couple of things. The first that the Avi can be Mekabel Get for his friend from the from his friend's master. In other words, even though I'm an Evan. Right and uh, um, um, and Randy is also he's he, another Evid, and his master right is, is Avrami. My master is Mayor, so I can go ahead and be Makabel the get from Avrami on behalf of you, as long as it's not from as long as we're not the same from the same master. Now, if you're going to say, hey, Adam uh, 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 so he says, Adam Lemar. If someone's going to say. This is a known halacha. So of course she can go ahead. Uh, uh, an eved can go ahead and, and be makabel aget on another eved's behalf. Why? <laughs> because we have the case of a pregnant woman that it, as long as she's pregnant, the So, excuse me. So they say in this case, right? Right. So if you you want to go ahead and say that this is not necessarily a case. Of uh, uh, basically an eved, right? Uh, an eved uh, acquiring uh, the the get for another eved. Why is that? Because maybe this case is different. We're talking about if she's actually already pregnant. And our the two gedolei says perish as davar. They explain the matter like this. Reb Zera, Reb Shmuel, Bar Reb Yitzchak, Chad Amar one says Hamani. Reb Yitzchak, Hamashacher, Chatsi Avdo, Kana. If one goes ahead and frees right half his slave, so. Uh, or, or, right, so uh, so such a, su- such a case works, right? Such a case works in that case, um, and therefore over here, so the fetus is basically half of the slave. So therefore, it's like one who goes ahead um, and uh, able to acquire it that way. Uh, and the chadom are my time with the rabbi b'hak saver uber yerech right? That uber the fetus is really a, let's say like a, a thigh or a body part of the woman. But as the commission he can law achar nevres, like he was, uh, um, you know, was, uh, he gave freedom to one of the limbs, which does work. So that's why it works. It doesn't work mitoras shlichos. It's not a kasha to say right that an evid could or cannot be a shliach because even in this case over here, right, we'll say that they can't go ahead and be a, sh- uh, a shliach when it comes to kedushin. I they can be uh, a shliach when it comes to uh, a shichar avadim. So that case is different. That's not a case of shichar avadim because that. Uh, he's, uh, you know, this uh, Uber is a, is an extension of the mother. Fine, Mishnah. So he says, "Af hanashim she'ena ne'manas lemar meisvala ne'manas lavi as gita." Right, even a woman who normally is not believed to say. Now we have a special halacha when it comes to women, married women. If uh, the husband we, we suspect is dead, all you need is one uh, witness, even if it's a woman who is normally not kosher uh, avis. So even a woman can go ahead and testify. However, there's five women we do not trust for them to testify that your husband died. Why is that? Because what do those women really want? They really want the woman to think that she's. Uh, single, right, or whatever she's, uh, you know, she's uh, a widowed. She's going to go ahead and marry somebody else, and then when the husband returns, <laughs> and you know, she's also to her husband, and you know, it, it goes from there. It creates, you know, this whole situation. Now, <laughs> so why are these five women I trust? Let's see who they are. 
So but even normal women who are not believed to say the husband died, they are believed to go ahead and bring a get. We trust them to bring the get. Chamaisa, her mother-in-law, right? It's the mother-in-law, daughter-in-law relationships, right? Bas Chamaisa, her sister-in-law, the daughter of her mother-in-law, the Tsarasa, her co-wife, would love to see you know her get divorced. The Avimta, also uh her her sister-in-law who's married to her her husband's brother, because you know, potentially if they, they die without kids, they would uh, you know be uh, co-wives. Her Bas Baila and her stepdaughter, so all this. Do not have this woman in, in mind, so they're not believed to say that the, that uh, he, the husband died, but they are believed to bring the get. So what's the difference? Why are you say in one case the trust, one case or not? Because the get we're not necessarily going based upon the verbal testimony of this one lady. Rather, we depend on the document that's being bought. So therefore, since we rely on the document, they, we trust them enough to bring the document. So it's going to be a, so so those people who would be excluded to say my husband died. No, no, this, the, the, her husband died. Her husband died. Right, died. right. These is, are all, all kosher to, to bring. bring the, yeah. Correct, correct. So what's the difference between the get the me? Because the writing is is uh, you know proves the point. Haisha Atma via Sagita, even when her, she herself can go ahead and bring a get. She can go ahead and bring the base and says, My husband gave it to me, it was written sign in front of me. She brings the base, and she, a woman herself, is believed. Now, just like a woman is not believed, these five women, let's just call it one, one of the cases, the mother in law. Just like the mother in law is not believed to say, Right, your husband died, so too she is not trusted to go ahead and bring a get. We assume it's forged. So I to cash in our Mishnah, Stira. So I see like cash a con barrets, kind of a chutzars. One air to sell, the other is chutzars. Barrets and air to sell the lav adibura di da kosam chinon, where we don't go ahead and rely upon any, we don't, they don't need to say anything, right? You don't have to say, fun enough, fun enough. Let me just bring the, the, the get. So she's believed that, right? Because we don't have to trust her, right? But chutzars, however, the chutzar, the bura di da kosam chinon, we have to rely upon her saying it was written in front of We have to trust her words. Love her, she's not believed. Summerly Abaye says Abaye, Adaraba. No, opposite. Think about it more. Eve come is Opposite is, is logical. Why? But Aretz and Eretz Israel. Now remember, in Eretz Israel, if no one says it's written and signed in front of me, and the husband, you know, then it was given to her, the husband says this is forged. So then we listen to the now well, there's the husband, but then all of a sudden it's one verse one, right? We take his claim seriously that it was not him. So in there to sell the Asi Baal Ma'arer, if he comes to go ahead and complain, Mashkichim Bey, right? We go ahead and we listen to him. And now there's all of a sudden, hey, why well, did you go ahead and remarry to somebody else? You were only divorced on a, on a forced document. So all of a sudden it creates this animosity. It creates this animosity. This is something a mother-in-law would do. So therefore, that's the reason why it, it, it doesn't. Deklamem and the Kikul Kamechavna. Goes to say, she got to try to go ahead and ruin it. Therefore, Lama Hamna, therefore, it's not believed. However, Bechutzarts, but let's say the mother brings Bechutzarts and says, once she says, it was written in front of me, the husband comes, we don't listen to him because once it said it was written in front of me, even if it was the mother in law, then nothing he can do could stop it. And therefore, uh, the, the individual is believed, and therefore, there's no way for the husband or for this woman to go ahead and be ma'arer, right, or to go ahead and create this kilkula in their marriage because we're not going to listen to the husband if he can't afford He's just going to be divorced. So, therefore, um, the, and you know, according to Baya, the opposite would be true. All right, we'll stop here because now it starts with another uh, longer discussion. Shkayach, uh, everybody, so tomorrow, Mr. Shem. Uh, same, uh, same normal type. All right. Appreciate you, man.